think I'm going to be going over steps in working on this Red McCall in Faber Castell Art Group Aquarella color pencils in my sketchbook. All supplies and materials will be listed in the description below. I will begin by starting to layer from the lightest yellow all the way up to an orange color and then finally to a red. And I will just continue to lay these colors down making sure I'm covering the page good and then slightly transition to the next darker color. Then next I will take my whitest Pentel Aqua brush and with water inside of the tube and I will lightly begin with the yellow and blending slowly upward into the red and then I will kind of come back down and bring some of that red into that yellow. Next I am using a magenta here to put in the shadows under the feathers. And now I will zoom in on that eye where you can see what I'm doing. I'm just putting the outline of the eye and getting in the dark areas. And then I will use a little bit of light green around the pupil. And then you can using that water brush to just brighten those areas up and blend those. Now I'll we'll begin working on the beak, putting in the lighter color and getting in my darks and my shadows using some of that magenta in the beak as well to brighten up the, the black areas when I come back over those and then using that water brush again to, to blend out those uh, shadows under the feathers. Again, now I'm just going to go back and brighten up, put some more detail back in the eye and go back over the feathers. Now I'm going to begin putting some of the color in on the uh, feathers that had some alternate colors other than the main color. And I just began with the, the dark green and worked upward into a lighter green. And then used that water brush to blend that. Now I'm going to go in and put down the main red color of the feathers. I'm going to blend that into the little bit of the green because we want that to blend in so that it looks like they're all, fe all one feather and not just two separate colors. Putting in those little colors around the eye. Going back and putting the rest of the coloring for the rest of the feathers. Using a, the water pen now to blend that out, blend that into the other the other colors that I have there blended into the green so that it all blends together. And then when that dries I will go back and I will put a darker red over some of the areas that need to be darkened up. And then I will just continue to blend that using my white to kind of bring some more detail into that eye and bring some highlight in it. back over that top area, putting some more red down and blending that out. Now going in and putting in more of the detailing in the beak there. And again you can see how putting that magenta down first kind of really breaks up that, that beak. Now using that water pen to brighten the areas that need to be darker and brighter. You will see how the water pen will make these pencils get much darker when you blend the areas with that water pen. Going back in and bringing out those shadows again now that I've blended all that out. Getting those shadows back in there that are under the feathers. Using that water pen again to bring out 
those highlights, those shadows, darken up those areas. some areas and brightening up those colors just continuing to work those colors until they are the, the contrast and the brightness and the darkness that I need them to be and there you have the finished piece and just going to sign that and then there you have it